Hello everyone, uh, Jose here with a tip on how to uh, look up for parts on Dell's website. Uh, I will, would like to start saying that I recommend that you get the part number from the serial number of the part itself. First and foremost, uh, obviously if you're pre-ordering, uh, you will come to Dell's website and get the parts from here. Although, uh, on the parts list that they have on the website, it does not show the motherboard that in I percent of the time. So, uh, for those cases, either you have to look at uh, if you work on a unit like that one previously, you can look at your past emails and see which motherboard you ordered. Uh, but I would recommend in those cases just go on site and get the part number for that motherboard from the motherboard itself. Okay. Uh, for anything else, you can just come to uh, support.dell.com, uh, click on one of these three tabs, uh, oh, handy dandy. Uh, you put in the service tag or the serial number of the machine that you're working on, click submit. And once that loads, you go to system configuration, click on components, and here you have all the part numbers that you need. Uh, it's a little hard to read, so just be mindful on what you're doing. Um, like I said, many times uh, it might be a little confusing, like it says that Nostex Intel line on motherboard, it might or it might not be the motherboard. Uh, most of the time it's not. So just be mindful of those things. Uh, the naming convention, uh, I would say it sucks, but uh, besides that, you know, you have your power cord and all other stuff. So pretty easy. Uh, please, for the love of God, do not look out for parts for any machine, Dell, HP, Lenovo, or whatever it is, for Google or Bing or Yahoo. Please go to the source, support.dell.com in this case. Thank you.